get in the world. Hold on, what we got? Hey V, Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. You could even call me a collector. Later, V. Why do I keep picking up that same thing? New message. Let me read this. Hold on. Hey, uh, Gina Jones here. Be in touch, okay? I'll be perfectly honest. I didn't know much about this game, but after I uh, finally got it, now that I'm playing it, I can now see why it's so good. We gotta get over there. Can I go around? Looks like I can go around. I don't want to rush through this area, though. Go check it out. Shit, come on! Hey there! Can I help you with anything? I sound so polite. Yo, this place is so lively, man. What we got cooking over no. here? The fucking smell. True. Sweet and disgusting. Hot to nine crab. It's crazy to think this game was seven years in the making. You know? The artwork, this is the concept art for this game, by the way. They're missing a poster, though. There's supposed to be a level right there. What's up with the burrito machines? Hold on, let me take this. How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. He did. <laughs> I like this guy. So, how about it? Man, I'm not trying to... Uh, let's do not today. Nah, not today. Thanks anyway. Whatever. I'll be here. Kind of just taking in the, the sights right now, I guess. Alright, entrance. Even the loading screens have dialogue. I think it's kind of funny. Got their own TV shows and stuff. Oh, I had a text message. Oh yeah, well, never mind. I was so caught up looking at all like the different posters and stuff. Beat on the brats. I'm not gonna do all that. Oh wait, I want to go to the other quest. From all of us at WNSU, uh, hold on. Fun, but sorry. Am I losing my mind? So, hold on, let me go to the quest line really quick. Actually, can you look at... I actually didn't try this. That's all the way back there. You can scan pretty much anybody. That's kind of cool. Alright, let's see. Map. Oh, I haven't looked at the map yet. Look at this thing. Oh my goodness. We're gonna... Let's go ahead and track this one. Cause that's what I was supposed to do anyways. Oh, it's back this way. I was in the right spot, so we're, we're good. We're good. By the way, I'm still playing on M&K if you haven't noticed <laughs> the way I'm struggling. Uh, in, okay, NCPD. Scanner hustles. NCPD will pay you to help fight crimes. Gigs fixers will contact you when you approach on a gigs location. Fixers. Local gigs available. A lot to take in. That little frame rate thing that just happened? I don't know what that was. And we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J O B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but. Just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated coupe. Uh, let me see. How did you manage this? Let's go down. How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? 
far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You and me? No. Oh, but t -Buck, she's the one that hooked us up. Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on. Ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. Dex to Deshaun. What's the latest spec on him? I know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacay. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. What was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off to hardcore virtues. I'm the important back. thing is he's back. It's a fresh group. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal is right on you now, I see. Don't see why not. Wait, but okay, hold on, let's see. I'll say why, why me? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. I'm fine. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a big of his own. Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at the landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Dios. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Alright, vehicle calling. You can activate your vehicle to current location by hitting V. So go. Top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's go, baby. Let's feel this factory new ride. Keep seeing system malfunction pop up randomly. I don't know what's causing that. Or if that's just in the game. I, don't, I have no idea. If it does it again, I might reset. You started it. First stop, Ripper Duck and Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I can't see anything. It's so bright. There we go. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. It really gets me, you know. Yo, it's so bright. Oh my goodness. Might change the car view in a minute, but I think I I like the first person. I don't know why. This is it. Come on, V. Find me one. Hidden gems. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. So, curious what you guys think of this game so far. As far as like, is it like the game to end all games yet, or what? You, or rather, not only. I can't form an opinion yet. I think it's spectacular right now. Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. All right, let's get going. You, All right, guys, before we go down there, I actually, I've reset my game because I think the system malfunction thing was popping up because all my icons are like right on the bottom left as well. But I did see this cat. Look at this thing. Hey, buddy. I can't. Oh, I can't look. Give me the evil eye. Like you better not touch my food. All right, here we go. All right, Ripper Doc. Uh, though a common practice, cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure. Specialist Ripper Docs are several operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Okay. Interesting. Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. 
had to jack into a client's neuro socket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Looking for upgrade. So, this is why the brights were so light outside when I was driving. This is why the system malfunctions. Okay, so it's actually part of the game. I thought my game, my, my game was bugged for a minute. Uh, V? Need some new kit. But tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Any tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Hmm. Pay you once the job's done? I don't even have the money. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later. With interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? This man got some claws Chair, too. Sit down and relax. At least he's gonna fix the system malfunction. I hope. Kuroshi optics, best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now check in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Yo, cyberware. Okay, cybernetic implants are mechanical. Uh, a place for organ. Okay. Hmm. Yo, we're check. Okay, we're changing up everything. Hands available. Ocular. Well, we gotta get this right. You know, I will say this, so we're going to select the slots, uh, I mean... Does it really matter? Hold on, do I drag and drop this thing? Uh, we got hand as well. There we go. That should do it, I'd imagine. I like how it costs that, but I do not have that at all. What about trading? Do I have anything I can trade? Oh, I do have... Wait a minute. Oh, wow, okay, so I actually have... Mark 1, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. This is gonna hurt, I feel like. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Feels like I'm at the dentist. Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? This game has so much in-depth stuff I need to like learn. Because it's like... We're still like in a tutorial type phase and we're only like... I would say we're a little over like an hour and 30 minutes in. Maybe more. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. How's it look? Feel all right to you? Better than ever. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. 
All right, scanning people. Scanning people to your optimal cyborg can provide you a lot of useful information, such as strong. Oh, how strong an enemy might be. Hmm. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's really the charm <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. All right, database of wanted persons. A database of individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanners. Since all wanted are dead or alive, the methods used to claim the reward entirely up to you. Nice. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Uh, I'm gonna say, what's this? What am I looking at? A mild stem. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Nice! Alright, go talk to Jackie. Here we go. Chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. Mm -hmm. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, and yo, listen up. Why is he I walking all like that? We're in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Hmm. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Alright, incapacitating enemies. Yeah, we've seen all this. I didn't use grenades. I didn't see any grenades in the training, so... I'm guessing we could get involved over there if we want to, but... So, he, he was getting glitched out back there. I am playing an early... I wouldn't say early. It's like a... About a day or so before the game dropped. Um, now I did the intros obviously afterwards, but like that's why it might not always seem to like be linked up together. But yeah, this maybe they have maybe the patch that's coming for this will fix stuff like that. I don't, I don't even know yet. Yo, Mr. V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. This dude's pretty chill. Something right off the bank. Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Uh, how they remember you, that's all that counts. Mr. Nobody's don't survive in the Night City. This is some sort of test. I'll just go to the first one. It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. Alright, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. 
Uh, the job. Tell them, uh, why me, me, why the show. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and Sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a court. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. I'm gonna say not at all. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolve in that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Mm, I'm gonna say, tell me about her. Yeah. Client. What's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. And the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. Alright, what's the issue? Here we go. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstorm, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Uh, I'm gonna say, so Brick's the main person. Let's see, who's the woman? Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Probably gonna be a quiet life, hopefully. Later now. So he gave me the scoop. I like that. Nice guy. He was chill too. All right, street cred. Performing certain actions reward you with street cred. Build your street cred to make a name for yourself in, in the Night City underworld. Open up new opportunities, okay? Jackster, talk to Dex. 
Yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Ah, uh, he's about to work over me. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us in a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom cleft it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the Gangoons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> Chingon. Uh, then there's the other thing. I'll say that one. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Uh, let's go visit... Start with the client. Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Alright, go to Lizzie's bar between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. I guess. Interest is over here. Oh, I, I could call my car. Well, do I really need my car? I don't think I do. I'll just go on foot. Yeah, well, it's going down pretty quick. Plus, I wouldn't mind seeing like, the actual city. I feel like they have a lot of art in this game. Granted, I'm seeing some of it over and over. Let me, you know what? Let me just, let me just drive. All right, here we go. I was gonna walk and then I was like, I saw how slowly it was going down. I was like, well, let me just go on and, uh, let me just go on and change. <laughs> God, this game is, it's like, if they made a Grand Theft Auto type futuristic experience, it's like, this is kind of like that. This is like a mix between like Watch Dogs and Grand Theft Auto, all the same type of games like this, except it almost feels like, like I don't, it doesn't feel like CD Projekt Red to me. Like they made The Witcher 3 was an amazing game, but I just, this feels like a whole like AAA game that, I mean, it's obviously a brand new thing. Oh my god, I just ran over that guy. Uh, at least warrant issued. Well, maybe they'll live? I don't know. I'm out of here. <laughs> I can't believe that just happened. We're closed right now. Oh no, I gotta wait. Do I really have to wait? It's 2.46 p.m. I wonder how time... Okay, it's gonna go past... Do I, I want this way to just wait? Hold on, let me see if I... I should probably hide the body, right? My well, body's gone now. Never mind. I guess I'll just hang out for a minute. I could do a side job. Hold on. Six. Really, I gotta wait. Mm. Am I gonna like scan anything? Imagine. God, there's so much stuff I could do. Hold on. Danger, moderate, moderate. But I, mean, I could do something while I'm waiting, I guess. You know? It's right over here. Oh, wait, hold on, I have a character level up. Oh, I didn't even see this. Okay. Um, alright. Handguns, assault, blade, reflexes. Bridge patrol, quick hacking, stealth and cold-blooded. Crafting and engineer. I feel like that's going to be very, very useful. But, at the same time... Probably want to use this. Eagle Eye. Yo, there's so many different ways you could do this. He now, now, the ha handgun in particular. Uh, need to increase damage on that. But this one just has the basic stuff. Here we go. Pistols, revolvers by 10%. Crit hit chance and damage and all that. Mm, with blades. Slow and steady. Armor's, well, armor is increased by 15% while moving. Combos and blades have 15% chance to apply bleeding. Yo, this right here? Strafing side to side? 
That actually might be really good. Let's go ahead and grab that. Crafting. Yo, wh how does this work? We haven't even used this yet. I like how I got all my clothes out early on. <laughs> I need to go put them up. All right, let's go do this other job, I guess. Kind of see what. It, wait, what is this thing? This looks different. It's like destination. I'm gonna guess this costs money, right? Oh, so you can just go any of these points right here. I don't really need to fast travel. Let's go over here, though. I figured I could do this, and then I can get back to the other thing. It's telling me just to go this way, but the thing's back behind us. Unless it's like you go... I'm just gonna keep on moving. 